Hey everybody, this is Kressel Snapdragon, and for this tutorial, I'm actually going to show you how to make the panels on your Mixer broadcast page. So this is an actual Mixer tutorial and not so much a Mix It Up Bot tutorial. So as you can see down here, I have the panels for my page that I made myself. I have the About Me section, a social media section, and a tip jar and stream loots. And I made all these panels myself. I'm going to show you what I did. And then the one panel section I don't have is for my computer specs. So we're going to go through the process of making the panels for my computer specs. So I'm going to begin here in Photoshop. I have a template for the ones that I made already. I'm just going to bring in a new frog. Image here. Okay. There's my new frog image. And now I want to change what that says. It's now going to say comp specs. I don't know why it's changing the, the font midway bunch blossoms. If you want me to make a tutorial on how I made these, let me know. I can do that too. All right, so now we have comp specs. Okay, so I'm going to save this in my designated info panels. I'm going to make it a PNG. I'm going to call it specs. Save. All right, now. This is the part that has to be the most annoying, <laughs> by the way. So we're going to go to Imgur. We're going to go to Imgur. And we're going to add a new post. So make sure you have an account and you can set these to private. And so I'm just going to go into my folder and I'm going to drag my image into here. All right. And now it's been uploaded into Imgur. And what I want to do is copy the link here. And now we're going to go back to Mixer. We're going to go to our page and hit edit. So these are my current panels. I'm going to put it down at the bottom here. I think I'm going to put it above stream loots. Okay. So to add the panel itself, and to add these lines, by the way, you just click this here. That's how you add a line to separate them. So I'm going to go to image. I'm going to post the image URL. Make sure you write .png. And now it should work. You have to write the type of file at the end of it. So .png, here it is. You can change how big it is here if you want to make everything more uniform. So I'm not going to change the size because I don't want to mess it up. And now I'm going to write the text. So here, just like in Microsoft Word, you can align the text into the center or to the left or to the right. I've been aligning mine in the center. And now I'm going to write my computer specs into it. So we're going to do operating system is Windows 10 64-bit, my CPU is an Intel Core i7. My RAM, I have 16 gigabytes dual channel. My graphics are an ATI Radeon RX 480, that's my graphics card. My storage is a Seagate 1863 gigabyte system. I don't have any optical drives, and my audio source is AMD high def audio. Okay, so those are my computer specs. Now you can do a few other things if you wanted to bold them. It's like using Microsoft Word. So we can bold this, for instance. And then you can also italicize them if you would like as well. I'm going to add another line here. Okay. 
And you can also italicize them. You can put lines through them. You can add bullet lists if you want to. It's just like using Microsoft Word. And if you want to add a link, you have to highlight the panel or the sentence or the word that you want to create a link for, highlight it, hit link here, and then put in the link that you would like it to redirect the viewer to. Now, if you want something that's animated, the only thing that seems to work is a GIF. So I made this in After Effects, but we weren't able to put it into the panel if it was, for instance, an MP4. So it has to be a GIF in order for it to show in this panel. And you also have to upload it to Imgur as a GIF. Now you can actually move these around using, right, the, the alignments up here. That's how I aligned it in the center, right? See, it's aligned in the center. That's how you can align your panels, okay? And you can put several panels next to each other in sequence as well. It's literally like using Microsoft Word. Okay, I hope that helped. Thanks. Thanks for watching.